What's up, MP? How you feeling? No complaints, man. I should be tired, but I got energy, bro. Like, every time I turn around, we got something good happening. Boom, boom. Things are boom. moving, man. And you've been impressive on and off the court. Look, I'm just, I'm just grinding, man. Just grinding. Well, speaking of, you heard a little metal? Uh, a little metal. Oh, yeah, you talking about old boy who freestyle just blew up? That's the one. Look, I was thinking, you know, maybe you and him could do something Whoa, together. Oh, chill out. Slow down. <laughs> I, I, maybe. I ain't heard nothing of him yet, you know? All right, yeah, that's the problem. See, dude's mad talented, but he just don't got a lot of people listening to him. See, you, on the other hand, people listen to him. You thinking I should help get the word out? I mean, yeah, that a little metal should go and get his own professional basketball career. But seeing as how the ship has probably sailed on that one, yeah, you should use what you do to help him do what he does. Okay. Huh? Like, go talk to him. I mean, I'll even set it up. If you guys gel, maybe you could, I don't know, do a show together, promote it. I mean, I know you're trying to prove your music skills are more than what you show on the mic. For sure, yeah. And keep grinding, bro. <laughs> okay. Andrew. Looking at your schedule coming up, it looks like there will be some off days, chance to, you know, give your body a rest. But it got me thinking, what's your perfect off day, MP? I mean, it's a little embarrassing, but when I get a day off, I usually just spend it watching film, bro. Just because I'm resting my body doesn't mean I can't find something about my game I can improve on or something I can take advantage of in my opponents. I gotta work to switch my brain away from basketball. But one thing like that, you know, I've been helping me was my very talented friend, Lil Meadow. He's a rapper, bro, actually, and he's putting together a show at the B-Box. A very slick bit of promotion there, MP. Hey, look, I'm just trying to spread the word on a show that's about to pop. Mm -hmm. You've been focused a lot on music lately, so are you worried that might open you up to criticism that you're not devoted to basketball? I'm not about to start worrying about what other people think. Bloggers, teammates, coaches, they all just jealous because there's nothing I can't do, bro. Look, come to Little Metal Show and you'll see how I created another superstar. All right. Well, thanks, MP. I hope the show goes well for you and Little Mel. Hey, yo, thank you, Andrew. Uh, I need more Johnny Luck in my life. What's going on, brother? Now, when I watch you play defense, I'm reminded of some of those 90s Knicks teams and how tough they were. How much does your toughness factor into what you're able to do on that side of the floor? Yeah, coach is tough and he wants to instill a toughness in us. So that's that's a big part of who we are as a ball club. And to be compared to the 90s Knicks is a huge compliment. Those dudes were ferocious, man. Like they didn't play. My pop still talks about them and he still hates Charles Smith, but hopefully we can get that chip they never got. But otherwise, yeah, love that comparison. Oh, I heard you on the radio. Very charming. <laughs> Look, man, I try. I try where I can. You know, people are calling me, asking me when they can see Little Metal. Wait, wait, so do we have a deal? Oh, almost there. Here's the thing. My car is filled with their stains, wrappers everywhere. I just need <laughs> joking. Of course we have a deal. I put you on a schedule. <laughs> I, <laughs> you had me going there, man. I'm... <laughs> but look, I appreciate you, boys. Thank you. Of course. Let's just hope people show up, huh, man? Are they coming? <laughs> Yay! I got it all worked out with the club. The show is yours, Lil' Metal. You serious? <laughs> serious. I got my own show. Got your own show, People homie. are coming to see Lil' Metal. Come to see you. You hear that, Pops? <laughs> they coming to see Lil' Metal perform. Hey. How much is your cut? You know what? I don't even care. However much it is, it's yours. No, 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 no. Look, I told you, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not in for that, bro. Oh, man, I gotta do something for you. What you need? Uh, valves, no, flanges, no pipe fittings. No, no, no. I'm good, bro. Lifetime supply, plumber's tape. No, thank you. I'm good, homie. <sighs> All right, well, look, I'm gonna hook you up anyway. I know you've been working on your music too, right? Yeah. How about this? I get your sweet DJ machine. You make some dope beats, and you pass the lit ones on to your boy, hey, Little Metal. Look, I could do that. <laughs> All right, man. Look, thanks. That's love, G. Absolutely. 